I'll get the charge sheets typed up. Now, just a minute, Roy. You know, let's not be hasty. I think we can make a deal. I don't like deals. You're going to like this one. If I give you the name of the bloke that stole that oven, you let Rodney and Grandad go. No charges. Yeah, all right. I'll let them go. And you also drop all charges against me. Oh, come on, Dell. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> Don't seem to understand what I'm saying, Slater. Once I give you the bloke's name, I'll be one of your grasses. Oh, Dell. <laughs> Dell boy. That is beautiful. <laughs> You would be one of my merry men. I'd have you in my pocket. I could bounce you about and make you dance whenever I felt bored. And if you ever stepped out of line, I'd let it be known on the streets that you're an informer. Yeah, I know. The deal's on, my old oppo. I'll drop the charges against you. You have my word. Your word? Your word means about as much to me as the guarantee on that ooky microwave. <laughs> now I want immunity from prosecution. And I want it in writing and I want it signed, sealed and delivered. I'll get it arranged right away, Derek. Oh, we're going to have a good future together, you and me. I can feel it. There you are, Del Boy. Your immunity from prosecution signed by the superintendent himself. What are you playing at, Del? What are they doing here? Oh, I thought it'd be interesting for them to see you in your real light. The great Dell boy. The man who could talk his way out of a room with no doors. Reduced to this. Grassing. God, tell him, Rodney. He's got me all ends up. I've got no choice. But you don't know his name, Dell. He was just a bloke in the market. I'll leave it out, Granddaddy. Mr. Slater was to believe our descriptions. He'd have his men searching for someone who's a cross between Tom Thumb and the Jolly Green Giant. <laughs> or with a deaf aid. <laughs> deaf aid. Well, now, I wasn't doing it just for myself. He threatened to plant something on you and set you up for a bit of bird. That is against the law. I'm the police. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling Dell. I've got to, Rodney. Otherwise, it'll mean you and me go down the road and Grandad's going to be left alone on the estate, see? I've got no choice. I've got no choice. Right, Mr. Slater, let's get down to business. Oh, Del. Del boy, those words are music to my ears. I will cherish this moment. Right, Odell. Who nicked it? They are free to go, aren't they? Yeah, they're free to go, no charges. They can leave whenever they like. Okay, give me his name. You've got nothing on me, either. No, you've got an immunity from prosecution. You've got less chance of a bull than the Queen. As long as I know. Right. For the third and last time of asking, who nicked the microwave off the back of the lorry? I did. 